don't want me to have peace in this community. Where's your mother? Where's your mother? Hey, in the name of Jesus Christ, Amen. Father God, I bind every principality of power, every manipulation, Amen. every enchantment. Fire. Father, I destroy them fire. in the mighty name of Jesus Amen. Christ. Amen. Holy Ghost fire. fire, Holy Ghost fire. fire. So what is it? Eh? You this hypocrite. Why have you decided to show your face in my house? Why won't you allow me and my children to serve our Lord God in peace? That question should go to you. Why not allow me and my son to have peace? Why have your son and his bunch of criminals decide to kill my son? Yes, and I know you are handy. You are involved in this matter. Me? Ha. You don't know what you are talking about. Because my Bible tells me that I do not fight against flesh and blood, but against principalities and powers. Yes. Rulers of this wicked world, witches and wizards. Let me tell you, my Lord God said in Exodus 19, 19 that he shall fight my battle and I will hold my peace. Yes. I don't know the stupid physical battle you are talking about because I do not engage in anything. Physical hey, battle. Really physical battle. Yes. Your son and his bunch of criminals, good ones, went and attacked my son. Eh? They want to kill my only son for me. And I'm sure, Agnes, you are aware of this plan to kill my only son. Look, they cannot kill my son. For as long as I live, nobody can kill my son. Go and ask, bring out your son. Bring him out to explain to me why he wants to kill my only son. Else, we end this matter in the police station. Else what? What do you mean else? Let me tell you, the Bible. my Bible tells me that right from the time of John the Baptist, the kingdom of God suffered violence. Yes. And only the violence, they take it by force. Let me tell you, you are not a man of God as you profess. You're only deceiving people. They don't teach you good doctrine. They don't teach you anything in that your church. Maybe my son did a little prayer exercise. Yes. Prayer warrior. He taught your son how to pray and march in the Lord. And you are here claiming that my son beat up your son. If your son is man enough, he's, if he's truly a, a child of God, he will know how to use this Bible and fight his battle. Yes. Eh, yes. Spiritual. Yes. I don't blame you. You had a son who is a, a spiritual thief and hoodlum. Yes, that is your son. A hoodlum and thief. But spiritual. So what, you know what? Since you don't want to bring out your son to explain what my son did to him, look, I'll meet you in the police station. I will go over there. We're not a thief. We're children of God. Yes. We don't fight physical battles. Yes. Our God is fighting for us. Yes. What's up? your brother? I don't know. Spirit of God be with you. Amen. Yes. This is the Spirit of God, sir, I should speak to you. Yes. That the things of the world should not be your problem. Amen. Think less. Whatever comes your way, take it the way you see it. Thank you, sir. You see, the Holy Spirit, the God I serve, is a merciful God. Amen.
is a God that gives you things when you want it. Amen. But when you think negative about things, you don't get to you. Yes, hmm? So believe that whatever you want, God will give it to you. Amen, eh? sir. And let me warn you. Okay. Let me warn you. There's a young man. There's a young man. There's a young man. There's a young man. Be careful of that young man. I don't know who he is, but I know the man is in your heart. Just keep thinking of him. Be careful of that young man. Okay, sir. Eh? If you believe in God, forget about that young man. Your man is on the way. Amen. Your man is on the way. Amen. Your man is on the way. Amen. Jesus. Father, Lord, bless her. Amen. Whatever she desires, give it. Oh, hey, my daughter, what is it? Why don't you ask you something? Some of the people that we preach to today are members of Standard World Church. What is wrong about that? Mother, you are preaching to them as if they are pagans. You told them to leave their church and come to our church. But I think all churches preach the same gospel. Hey, they need to leave that church. Because that church does not preach the true gospel of salvation. They need to leave their church and come to our church and receive the true message of Christ, the true message of deliverance, because it is only in our church that you get the true salvation message, the true doctrine, undiluted message of Christ in our church. But Mama, is salvation based on church or doctrine? I thought salvation come from the one God all the churches preaches about. <laughs> My children, have you forgotten that we have only two church, our church and other church. That church that you mentioned does not have salvation, so it cannot give what it does not have. Our church is the first church and the only true church that will give you salvation, give you repentance and also save you for Christ on the last day. You need to preach to them and bring them to the right church well, they are preaching the right message. In fact, let me tell you, my children, our church is the only church of Christ. The only church where God dwells by his word, in his spirit, is in our church. Our church is the only true living church. But mother, I hear that a blind man was healed in their church last Sunday. Are you trying to say that the healing was not from God? My children, you carry this word of God in your hand or you don't read it. See, in the later days, so many people will do miracles with different powers. You don't know the power that they use. And even the so-called miracle, you are not sure where the miracle is coming from. Some are arranged, some are acting, some are lying. Just so that they will claim that they are doing miracles in their church. So don't be deceived by all those things. You see now in my church, in our church, I am a deacon. So it is my responsibility and our responsibility to preach and win many, many, many souls to our church so that our church will continue to grow, 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 grow. Mama, for our church, I thought the souls are to be one for God. Why are you confusing yourself? Whether you win the soul for church or you win the soul for Christ, is it not the same thing? Christ is in all the church. Church is in all Christ. Why are you separating the two? It's one thing we are talking about. So you need to win more souls. Let us go home. Let us go home and cook. Eh? You are asking me too many questions. Instead of you children to join me, join hands together and Put more effort in this evangelism so that we can win many souls for Christ. You are asking me questions. But mother, I think we should just be preaching salvation to them instead of telling them to come to our church. Uh -huh. eh? uh -uh. See, you must tell them to come to our church. That is the message. If it is possible, 
everybody everywhere in the world, in this village. Bring all of them to our church. All your friends, everybody you know, tell them to come to our church. Be bringing them to the church. You know that we be first. Edema, 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 Tuneke, Edema, 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 Tuku, Edema, 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 Chinemema. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Amen. Welcome, Papa. Uh huh. <sighs> Papa, you came back late today. How was the evangelism? Uh, it was great. But we have problems. Problem. Problem. Yes. What happened? See that woman. He see that woman called Agnes. Agnes is our problem. Eh? Do you know Agnes goes round this village telling people to abandon our church? Standard word. Eh? Abandon our church to attempt their own. That our church is full with fake doctrine. Fake! But Papa, that's the same thing you always see. You say that their leaders don't practice what they teach. That's why you left the church. Yes. That was what I always say. I know what I am talking. You see, in their church, their leaders preach love and riches and giving. But they don't practice what they preach. Eh? What they do is collecting, collecting from the poor in the church. Is that a good leader? A leader that collects from the poor. Is that person good? Papa, how, how do you know? Keki uh, see, Malo. He got no big matter that the leaders are not practicing the same thing. My church. Ekena. The truth is you don't know. You don't know me. You don't know the God that I am serving. Yes. You see, we, we, the members of Standard Word, eh? our dream, our plan for this village eh? is to build schools. And our schools will be free of charge. For every member, every uh, orphan in this village, every child of a widow in this village, for their own school, eh? the collect fees, even from the poor. Eh? Man, you know, said that contributed tight to build their own school, the space for school fees. Eh? Is it right? Well, Papa. That's not enough reason to condemn Swan's church. I want to go to the market. Can we get Jen and get Mejima so I can buy apple to continue the cooking I was doing? Point of order, my son. I did not condemn any church. Rather, I am condemning the leaders in the church. Okay? Uh, please go and um, prepare the offer. I'm very hungry. 
that's what I'm going to do. I've already boiled the rice. It's just for me to get the water. Hey, yeah, since you have already boiled the rice, why don't you put oil and pepper and salt ah. so that I can turn it and eat? Hey, you are shouting, Papa, talking you as, if, enjoy it talking like as if you 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 can cook more than your mother. We will go get a bit naga. Papa, since, since my mother left, how long uh, have you not been eating my? Chokode, ere mama, chukode di ma, chukode di ma, ere ma, chukode di ma, ere ma, chukode di ma, onye wem, ere ma, ere ma, ere ma, ere ma, ere ma. Already. Yeah. Yes, so I need to finish on time so I can cook it. I want to go to the stream and fetch water. You? Is it supposed to be your turn today? I thought it's your sister's turn. Or don't you children do it turn by turn again? Hey, Mama, we are still doing it. Just that she complained of having a headache. So I want to help her and fetch her turn today. Headache. Okay, I'll give her medicine. Maybe she should treat my leg. Yeah? When you go, you come back on time so that I can come and cook this rice. Uh -huh. Where is your brother, Obiora? I did not see him when the church dismissed. That one. When we came back from church, we didn't see him at home. Probably he left church earlier. Oh. Maybe he went to see that he's good for nothing for the fine. Uh -huh. Why does Obiora want to bring shame upon himself and upon this family? Why can't he just choose to be responsible? Eh? What does he want people to say about me? If people hear that my son, a deaconess in a prestigious church, like Church of Saints International is a criminal or that he's moving around the village with criminals. He wants to bring bad reputation upon me. Me, Moa Dikones Agnes. Hey! Mama, I don't need to think about him. Let me go now so that I'll come back on time and go before you finish selecting the rice. Let him come back and eat. No problem, go. Make sure you come back on time. Remember you have exams. I will, Mama. I'm going to... I'm going to... My love. <laughs> How did you know the one? <laughs> Why wouldn't I? <laughs> you kept me waiting. I'm sorry. I was delayed by my mother. You know, today is not my turn to go to the stream. But I had to convince them that I'll come out and see. Uh, I missed you. 
but we saw two days ago. <laughs> Don't you know that two days without you is like two decades of emptiness? I mean, you add meaning to my life. You flatter me with your words, and I miss you so much. Each passing day, my heart yearns more and more for you. Oh. And my life is helpless without you. Well, you won't have to feel helpless anymore because I'll be here for you every time. Always. I know. Um, anyways, how is your father? He's fine. But he won't stop expressing his anger towards your mom and your church. He's always talking about how your mom deceives people and all that, blah, blah, blah. I'm just tired of all this unnecessary church battle of supremacy. I'm just tired. I'm also very tired. My mother is no different at all, especially since the mother did the college. She's always looking for ways to spark up disputes among the churches and it's very tiring. Well, that's your business. So, my love, how are you preparing for your admission exams tomorrow? Definitely, I'm preparing very well. I wouldn't want you to decline your admissions again because of me. Well, that was in the past and I will always wait for you no matter how long it takes. Because us getting admission into the same institution is our way of leaving our prayers and their problems. That's why I love you. <laughs> So, what did you get for me? Guess. What? You don't know good, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Just tell me. I'll tell you later. Okay, let's go. Anybody too. Alright, let's go. Before I press, I'm going to go. to see your friend that's your good for nothing friend i know he's the one you went to see Eobiora, when and how did you leave the church which one will i ask and is it your when i be your how besides uh, if i is not a good for nothing ah. he's the only one that understands me in this village hmm. please stop insulting me i don't like it you must be very stupid to talk to me in that manner yes what is good about that your friend? And what is good about you? Who is influencing who? Eobiora. What are you learning from him and what is he learning from you? Obiora. Why did you leave the church before dismissal? My heart some important business to attend to. Alongside with Ifine. Hmm. Beside your, 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 your priest was wasting my time. I had to leave. The priest? was wasting your time. Oh yeah, you left now. Businessman, Dangote, you went to do business. You are back. Welcome. Give us money for food. Hey, now. Give us money. Businessman. Busy man. Hey, Obiora, why have you decided to be a turn on our flesh in this family? Eh? Obiora, your father is no more. You are my only son. Instead of you to, to help me raise your siblings, you're otherwise. Eh? Stop. Please stop. Now, Mama, stop this. I don't like you. You started again. I should stop. What will make me stop? Are you changing? Are you deciding to change? Or will you ever change? Is it not the same talk every day, every day? Obiora, why are you doing this? I have pleaded with you, Obiora, to learn a trade. But you refuse. Learn an electrician, no. Babin, no. Celorin, no. Plumbing, no. Okay, go back to school and complete your education. God forbid. 
What else do you want me to do, Obi or Ragini? I will look for a better job. All these things you are mentioning, they don't give money. I've told you, just calm down. I'll look for a lucrative job and do something that will pay something huge. Hi. Obi or you have a serious problem. Mama, you're still picking rice. Shake it. You are still picking rice. You will not eat this rice. Some persons by now in the house are eating their second square meal. Eh, come and eat. Come and eat. Since you will not be useful to me, I, 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 I am your cook. I'm the one that will be cooking food for you to come back and eat. Your mates are not cooking for their parents. Hi. Oh, what kind of challenge is this? God, please help me. Eh? Where have I offended you? Where did I go wrong? Why can't this boy just be obedient like other children and be useful for himself? Thank God, please have mercy. Help me with this boy. your sister? Why is she not with you? I did not see her. You did not see her? Uh-uh. But it was around 11 that I heard they finished writing an admission exam. I even thought that maybe she was waiting for you so that both of you would come back together. Yeah. I did not see her. I did not see anybody. I did not see anybody. Else. You mean you didn't see her while coming back? Hmm? <laughs> it's better not to be what I'm thinking. Wait, did that useless boy, Ikena, did you see him in school today? Ikena? Yes. Yes, I saw him. He also came to write the, the admission exam. Hey! He was in school today. And now Namaka is missing. Okay. She will come back and meet me in this house. No problem. I'm going for this side. Eh, hey, there's rice in the pot. Okay. Mm. Hey! Amaka. Hey. She'll come back and meet me in this house. Okay. What the corners? The corners daughter. Daughter, come and meet me in this house. I see. 
you know, people think that a Zan is just where you come man. I pity the poor girl, honestly. But today's question was quite difficult. Hope you answered them. Don't you trust me? I trust you. I smashed all the questions. I didn't leave anyone unanswered. <laughs> that was my girl. Well, in a few days' time, the results will be out and boom, we'll be heading to the high institution together. And free for our parents' shackles, of course. I can't wait. At least my mother and your father will not be there to bother us again. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. I just can't wait. My love, what's the problem? Why the sudden change of countenance? It's nothing. Fine. Come on, you can talk to me. I mean, we happily came here, but now, all of a sudden, you just changed. What's the problem? You can talk to me. I'm just thinking about my mother. I, I don't know how she's going to get the money to send me to a higher institution. It never since her father died, she has been the one trying to do everything possible for us to survive and it has not been easy on her. Now that I've gotten her admission, I don't know how she's going to do it. I don't know how she'll get the money for my tuition fee, pay for my textbook, my house rent and every other expenses I will encounter in the university. I'm just, I'm just having this thought of banishing the idea of going to university. No, 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 no. Come on. I wouldn't want to bother her with the expenses and everything when I know that we don't have any money anyway. But my love, you know we've come too far to give up now. You should know that I will do my possible best to help in any way I can. And besides, once we get to the high institution, we can look for a side doors and help our parents. You know well that my dad can take care of my expenses, so I'll share everything with you. That way you won't have to bother for some things. Thank you so much. It's my job. <laughs> Thank you so much. What will I do without you? You're my motivation. Thank you. Well, I just want to see you happy and become great in life. That's just that's just what I want from you. And I'm not going to let you down, I promise. I know that. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, you. you better be going now because I know that your mom must be really, ah, really that angry woman. by now. Your sister just left you for you. Don't we have enough time for ourselves? Your mom is still here. No, when we get to the institution, we'll have enough time to ourselves. Don't worry. I'll miss you. I'll miss you tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, we'll see you tomorrow. I promise. We'll see you tomorrow. I promise. Go, Joe. Uh ah. -uh. Kissy, when I went to the hospital, I was going to go to the hospital. I was going to go to the hospital. Site na konya mwanyo Jesu Kristo. Site na ya anye ketele oke na mara nke chineke. Nka anye no ni ne yi kwa. Mara nka ti. Choose one. Choose one. You don't want to choose. Eh? Okay, I will choose for you. Never use one. I'm coming for school. We are going to write my admission exam. Yeah. After which? Mm. Amaka, you went out with that boy again. You were with Ikena. Amaka, I've warned you. Ikena has nothing good to offer you. Ikena has nothing good to offer you. He's after your life. 
He wants to destroy your life. Amaka, what are your mother sit down here in this seat to see? Even if you like, climb the highest Hiroko tree. Amaka, my daughter, you will not see it. I am warning you, stop moving with that boy. He will destroy your life. And I can leave Iken alone. I am warning you. I am warning you for Mama, the last time. Mama, Ikena is my friend and he likes me a lot. He is well for me. Ikena is your friend. Yes, and Mama. he likes you a lot. Yes, Mama. 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 Stop going out to chicken that you know not here. Okay. Okay. This is just the beginning. Eh? So, you'll be back late. That means we'll have enough time to ourselves. I'm scared. Don't be scared, I'm here. You know your father, that is his face. Papa, good afternoon. Good afternoon, sir. What is the good about this afternoon? Eh? Now, what she do? Papa, she, I, um, yes, she, she escorted me home. She escorted me home. She escorted you home. Yes, sir. That means you got lost. Or you were blind. That was why she escorted you home. Now you. Leave my compound before I descend on you. Total of death. Uh, Papa, that's too harsh now. Hey! Eh? Why are you for good in Now, get inside. Uh, get inside. Get inside! Papa, why are you pursuing my business? Oh, yeah, And you didn't buy another one to replace it. You know, you know I don't take secrets now. I like taking weed so that I go high. Wait, I don't understand. <clears throat> Obiora, so you have seen Central Bank of Weed. No, now, what I do now in this village is to save weed or better store weed for people. For touts. That's what I do now. Okay? It's if I you know the reason why I gave you that weed. I gave you because I didn't want my mother to see it. You know how she can be. You're just fuck her. Why now? No, now you gave me weed to keep for you. We that do not have parents, we that are wayward children, we will now store weed for the good children like you. Are we? I don't understand. No, now. But uh, my brother, I'm sorry to tell you that uh, you gave this weed to the wrong person. Because there is no way I will stay in the same house with weed 
and the weed will be there doing nothing. It's not possible. Um, but don't worry. Don't worry. You are my friend and I'll buy you wheat. Aye. Yes, but uh, that will be after I go to the city and join the HK that I'm planning to join. And then I'll start making some good dollars. Then I'll buy you enough wheat, you know. Wait, 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 wait. You, if I enter HK, wait. You of all people that can't stay awake. You that can sleep like a dead elephant when they come on Sebapo. Obiora. Obiora. It's my name. Obiora, you know, the only reason you can talk to me anyhow in this village and get away with it is because I decided to take you as a friend. Only if you get me. They cannot do anything now. Anyways, it's okay. Don't worry. I will shock you. I know say they see me less less because all of us did this village. I've already spoken to Kendola. You know Kendola? The one that bought Benz two months ago. Okay, yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Yes. I've spoken with him and he promised to help me talk to his boss. And in no distant time, I will go over to the city and join the IHK. And with the energy I have, when I start bombing with the energy I have, trust me, it's, it will just, um, in a matter of weeks, did I say weeks? No. Just give me a few days, I will start picking good dollars. Uh, when I start bombing with the energy I have, till then, but for now, how can I get money to burn all down? My lips, they scratch me. Say your mama get good. What you consign good, consign money while they talk. <clears throat> you know what you consign good, consign money while they talk. Yeah, no problem. Let's let's enter town now. We will definitely see someone that has misplaced his goods on the farm or something. Eh? Yeah? Okay, no, just... <laughs> you know, Mama and Kichi, that woman has a lot of farms. So let's follow her back here and check something. I'll ah, go job. <laughs> Oh yeah, that It was a peaceful church that taught us the best of gospel. After some time, politics grew into the church and people could not cope with it again. The church members pay to conduct burials and marriages and every other thing. The church contributed money to build church school and after contributing money, they pay huge sums of money as school fees. This continued in the house of God. Probably one day, this young boy decided to form his own ministry that is called today Standard World. Ever since then, the battle of survival continued. That was why I had uh, two churches in this community. Um, Father, from what you said, the two churches practice the same doctrine, just that they have different ways of expressing themselves. Yes, we serve the same God, but uh, he started attacking our members, you know, talking against our ministry and church. We can't fold our hands and watch them attack us. That was why we have to fight back. <sighs> but Father, 
mean, we serve the same God. I believe we should set aside our differences and focus more on the work of God. Focus on the work of God and separate ourselves from this church rivalry. All right. But we have to be careful so that we don't fail for our enemies to laugh at us. Hmm? Well, son, I, I want to go to my rice meal and see how the operator is working on the rice. Okay, son. So how is your mom and your brother? They are all fine. They're okay. I miss you. I miss you too. You know, today my dad was telling me stories about how the church started and how they arrived with and everything and even how they separated. See, there was a time even uh, when your it, mother was... Um, I will listen to the story later. I want you. Eh? What is it again? Are you sure about this? He came. I'm very sure about this. I've been a virgin all my life. And I want you to deflower me. I want you to be the symbol of our love. Please. Let's do it, please. Well, I'm scared. I, I... He came, you don't need to be scared. You don't need to be scared. Please, don't change your mind, please. How, how do we go about it? <laughs> Don't worry about that. I came prepared. I've already arranged a place for us to stay. I am here to preach to you the message of salvation of our Lord and personal Savior, Jesus Christ. In the beginning, God created man and gave us dominion over all that he has created. But today, man is running helter skelter in search of what God has already given to him. Man is searching for favor. Man is searching for peace of mind. Man is searching for love. Man is searching for prosperity, good health. But all these things were, were what God gave to man during creation, creation, free of charge. Why is this so? Because man has decided not to live by the word of God. If you want the word of God to work for you, you must live your life according to the dictates and standards of this Bible. 
every day of your life, you must live your life according to the standard of the Bible. In order for you to know more about how to live your life as a child of God, I want to invite you to our church this Sunday. Make our time to come and worship with us, fellowship with us this Sunday at All Saints Church. Anyway, someone has already invited me to Standard Work Church. Hey! What did you just say? Standard Work Church. Why do you want to perish? Why do you want to go to Hellfire? Sister, I am telling you about a place where you will come and you will hear the word of God all refined. You will hear the word of God in a way God meant it to be taught. Sister, don't go there. That way is not the way of Christ. That church is not the church of Christ. Eh? That way is not the way of Christ. Do you want to go to Hellfire? Sister, do you want to go to Hellfire? Do you want to be destroyed? Sister, don't you ever go to Standard Church. Go to All Saints Church so that you can receive Jesus Christ. Am I expecting you this Sunday, sister? Please. Please. Oh, God bless you. God bless you. Okay, Ruo. Say, Aria. Pere, Kwana, Ozoma. Ozoma, Chuku, Ale. Repent and receive Jesus Christ. Repent and receive Jesus Christ. Repent and receive Jesus Christ. Repent and live by the word of God. Repent and live your life by the word of God. Repent and receive Jesus Christ. Repent and give your life to Christ. Try to leave a way and sneak out so that you do another one. Okay. <laughs> I didn't know that you were this sweet. I'm <laughs> glad you love it. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Why, you oh my? Ah. <laughs> Seriously, we didn't have this one. daughter and that deaconess Agnes of all saints church Amaka look at the kind of life you're living life of sin and sinful desire with this son of a hypocrite Mama good afternoon hold your good afternoon to yourself hold your greetings what are you doing with my daughter Mama Mama I Mama I Mama hey! Don't you dare call me your mother. I cannot give birth to something like you. It is obvious that you don't know who your mother is. Because if you do, you will not be calling me, Deaconess Agnes, your mother. Who raised you? When you get out, you say that. Get out! Mama, mama why now? Why, why did you ask him to leave? Why did I do what, Amaka? Look at the life you're living on the streets. Life of sin and sinful desire. What message are you preaching? What are you showing people? What life are you living, Amaka? Amaka, my own daughter. Amaka, you are shameless. Do you want to perish? Do you want to perish, Amaka? Amaka, do you want to go to hellfire? It's good for you to repent. It's better you repent before you go to hellfire. Meet me at home. Mama, I will not finish. Why can't you allow us to love? Eh? Eh, why can't you allow us to love? Mama, I don't like it so. Amaka, my daughter. 
What is going on? What is happening? I know you as a very obedient and responsible daughter. But on this very particular issue, you have chosen to disobey me. And I don't understand. Mama, I love Ikenna. And Ikenna loves me too. I understand your feeling as a woman. But at your age, there's a lot that you don't understand about love. Love has so many meaning. Love has so many definitions. It depends on what you call love. But to me, your mother, Amaka, I call love satisfaction. Amaka, as a man that Ikenna is, you don't yet understand him. Even him, Ikenna, does not even understand himself because of his age. Likewise, you. Ikenna does not even understand you as a woman yet. There's a lot of things about you that Ikenna still need to understand. In the issue of love, in the life of a woman, you have so many cardinal points in your life where you need to be satisfied for you to completely say, I love this person. He has reached my satisfaction. One, sexual satisfaction, which is very, very common. It's just one part of it. What about financial satisfaction? What about responsibility satisfaction? What about relationship satisfaction? The way this very particular man relates to you, to members of your family, and to your friends. What about emotional satisfaction? Do you know if he's going to be an angry type? A wife Peter? What about other behaviors? Have you checked all these areas of his life? The same thing goes on in the life of a man. When a man sees a girl and the girl is tall, she's fair, the man will say, wow, I love this girl. She's pretty, I love her. But what about other areas? Can she satisfy this man in those other areas? For example, is the girl respectful? Relationship with your relatives? Is she ready to accept your family as her own? Hard working? Can she cook? Can she take care of your money? Can she take care of your home? Can she, as a woman, handle your emotions as a man? These are things that comes into play before you say, I love this person, I love that person. And all these things, you and Dikena does not know any of it. That is why I am telling you that Ikena has nothing to offer you. This love of yours is just infatuation. It's going to destroy your life, Amaka. Amaka, between Ikenna and myself, Ikenna's parents belong to a rival church. Between these two churches, we are in the battle of supremacy. But Mama, is the church battle for supremacy more important than your daughter's happiness? Amaka, that boy called Ikenna has nothing to offer you. He has nothing to offer you in this life. 
Amaka. We are preparing you for something big. Ikena has nothing to offer you. Now let me tell you this. A sister in our church, my friend called Adana, has promised me that she is going to introduce you to her cousin when he comes back from Canada this Christmas. She wants to introduce you as a wife to her cousin. Mama, Ikena has a lot to offer to me. And besides, I cannot marry someone I do not love. Ah, leave that matter. Amaka, the same way hatred, wickedness, and heartbreak grows in a marriage and in affairs of man and woman. That is the same way love and affection, care and kindness grows. Amaka Bovo, money, money breeds love in any relationship. this afternoon. Come here. Come here. Come. What is that your name? My name is Amaka, sir. Good. Amaka. Good. I want to use this opportunity to beg you and your mother eh, to stay away from my son and my family. Ikena is the only thing I have. He's the only human being in my house I have. I don't want anything to happen to him. So I am warning you for the last time. Stay away from Ikenna. I don't want anything to happen to him. But sir, Ikenna is my friend and I like him a lot. That is not my business. I don't care. Eh? I've told you what I want to tell you. Have a nice day. If Amos, if Roy, in our talking and nature, I boom. I have boom. I have one. I have one more guy. I have one. Amaka. Serious. Why not leave this boy? You know, give me a no wake now. So you have your own son. Give me a would you? What what sort of stupid advice is this? Why will you tell me to leave it Kenna alone? It's not like that, my friend. You know, eh? This is becoming too much now. Eh? Give me a look working now. I know. I don't even know why I'm still listening to you. Wait, now is that why you're walking out on me? Chell, be a good eh? Yeah, let me tell you first. Imagine Kendola. Kendola of yesterday. What happened? The one I used to flog, beat up in this in this school. Kendola called me and said eh, that his boss said I should give him a little time that he, he will get back to me. Can you imagine? Because he has bought uh, Benz, because he saw some dollars. <laughs> if I you see. I've told you many times. I've told you, but you won't believe me. Your village people are very, very strong. And they will make sure they do everything possible to make you useless in this life. Oh yeah, what, what, I don't understand. What sort of stupid talk is this? What kind of stupid talk is this? Eh? Well, I can see it is obvious that this secondary school that you did not finish it has made you very, 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 very tall. Your brain knows the work well. That is the only reason why you will not understand the difference between don't come again and give me a little time. I just told you that they said I should give him a little time. That they will get back to me. 
Um, if I, I've been thinking of something. You know, when you leave this village, I'll remain alone. There will be nobody to talk to. You understand? Nobody to vibe with. And you're my only friend I have. You understand? And I don't know eh, if you can help me talk to them that I want to follow you. You understand? This is a friend helping a friend. You understand now? So I can start making, I can start making dollars, you understand? Obiora, Obiora. You want to follow me to the city and make some big dollars. When you finish insulting me, talking to me anyhow, now you want me to help you, to take you to the city, to help your useless life. I'll help you, but on one condition, my friend. Yeah, what is that condition? All the insults you have given me in this place, you apologize for all of them. Fine, you are taking it. I'm waiting. Uh, we are friends now. What we are, we are friends. Alpha, it's okay. And I'm sorry. Um, I'll help you because you are my friend. I'm just happy that finally you have started developing some brains. I've started thinking like a man. See, we cannot make good money with this our petty petty stealing in this village, stealing foul goat corn. We cannot make good money from it. The only way we can make money is by leaving this village, going to the HK, bombing, hustling, keeping late nights, like our mates. Then we will make good money and come back to this village and become big boys. Uh, you are right. See, uh, when we get to the city, once I make my dollars, I will just come to the village. Be a good one big mansion. Understand? Big one. My my parents, everybody, back out. Move into my mansion. Obiora, you have not seen money. You have started talking about the kind of house you want to build. It's because I am very very sure that money will come. I am very very sure. See, once I go there, I'll that, make money. that one is your business. That one is totally your business. Um, what I wanted to tell you is that when we go there, I know my first dollars will come in bulk. Once they it comes and I uh, will come back to the village. I'm coming over to your place straight to pay your sister's bread price. Eh? Can you vlog? Come, if I don't mention my sister's name again. Look, look at you. Look at you. Come on, Maria, sister. It will not work. It will never work. It can never work. Not in this life. You want yourself. Oh, yeah, now. Let's see it now. Um, see. I want us to go and check this woman. The woman we sold foul to now. Oh. Uh, she's still owing us a thousand naira. Mm -hmm. so no problem now. We'll go there and collect our money. At money. least. We yeah, need money now. We need every money we can get so that we can transport ourselves to the city. Who is so you? We'll start saving from there. Who is so yeah. No problem. So, and we need to thief like more files now. Mm -hmm. You read your pressure now. Now we, we need to start stealing goods. If possible, cow. You know it's goods. Let's stop this our uh, foul stealing. Do not bring good money. Let's start stealing goods. If we see cow, what is good? They are planning uh, barrier. We bring cow by mistake. We steal it. And sell it to them. You will lead now. You will lead now. What? You will start leading now. Is you think it's by insulting me? When you finish insulting me, you now come and start telling you lead your pressure. You lead your pressure. What, what is your problem? Now this small city you want to go. See, you, there are two reasons you should stop insulting me. The first reason is because if you insult me, I can decide to dump you in this village and go to the city. Two, if I don't lead your pressure, there will be no money for you to go to the city. So if you go to the city without me, you will trek. So you know. Okay. So you need to stop insulting me. Well, the, the this small city you want to carry me. You are, not, you, are, you are now using this opportunity to talk anyhow. Look at you. Where are you running to? Are you in a haste to go to the city? Why are you hastening to the city? Respect yourself. Respect yourself. You want to go to the city. Where else you going? Amaka. Lovers. Amaka. What are you doing with this? Eh? I 
thought Mama have warned you many times to stay away from this from this idiot. Yeah. Obiora, why are you calling me a fool? Yes! Come there, our son. Come on, shut your mouth. See, if I hear pin from you again, you see this your head that is white. I will divide it into two and you go home with one part. Idiot. Imagine the idiot. Imagine if you have the gods to talk back at me. Are you not worse than a fool? And you? You should be the first and the last time I will see you with this monkey. Oh, he's my friend now. Come on, with you. I'm talking, you are still standing here. Come on. <laughs> Why are you beating? Come on, come on, go home. In I will I will change up for you. Go home. 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 Go Go home. Go 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 You mean you saw all these things? Yes, and you just kept quiet and did not do anything. Um, mother, not to worry. I gave him a serious warning against seeing him with my sister again. Just that. Do you think that, that will affect him? Do you think that will cause any change? Do you know how many times I've called that boy and warned him to leave your sister alone? I've talked to him gently, he did not listen. I've talked to him shouting and lamenting, he did not listen. Eh? I was thinking that you would have applied force on him to make him leave your sister. Eh? Yes. After all, the, king, the, the Bible says that right from the time of John the Baptist, the kingdom of God suffered violence, and only the violence shall take it by force. But mother, has it got into that? Applying force? Of course! Don't you know that that boy is planning? In fact, he's already doing it. He's putting sand sand inside our garret. Oh, have you forgotten that I'm preparing your sister, Amaka, to marry the cousin of my friend, Adana? when the boy comes back from Canada. Eh? That's a nice idea. But mother, you didn't tell me all these things now. No. So this boy is trying to block someone that will liberate this family from poverty. That was the ta, ta, oh, mommy. It will not happen. It will not happen. Okay, see, eh, mother. Don't worry, okay? I have my eyes all over this village and I promise you when next I see that boy close to my sister I will teach him a lesson he will never forget <laughs> and when next time he sees Amaka he will take to his heels wow. that's my son next time he see Amaka he will run 10 meters away from Amaka give him a run don't worry just me. <laughs> I don't understand now. What are you trying to say? Is it that I'm not important in this family? I did not say that. Oh. I only said, Kobolo no Kine. Is there any food? For oh. doing this one, there's food. Thanks. Thank you. Mommy. Mm. Mm. Well, Okucharanka. Nebuka Dinezi. Daniel. Daniel I know you must be upset with me for not standing up for you yesterday. I mean, I wanted to react, but I just didn't know what held me back. I couldn't stand your brother treating you in such way and talking to me in such manner as if I'm a kid or something. I'm not angry though. 
I didn't expect it to react because my brother was with that his friend. You know, that his friend is a very notorious stout in this village. That everybody, at the mention of his name, everybody trembles. <laughs> so I wouldn't want him to give you injuries or enjoy you. Ah, go wow. Hope you didn't. See, see, see what my brother did to me. See, see, see. My, my, my back. He gave me mark on my back. Well, I'm, I'm sorry. Let me massage it for you. Because I love you. Yeah. I, I hope you're feeling better. Yes. And uh, um, I wanted to ask her, yeah. if we go to the university, what and what are we going to be doing this? Like, how are we going to be seeing our daily activities? Let's start now to plan everything. Well, one week, once we get there, we'll be free. We'll be happy. I mean, you, you won't have to be coming to bushy places like this or hidden places to meet. We'll be free from our parents and your brother and his friend. And also, we'll just have fun. All right. And also fun. focus on our studies. You know, yes, that's, that's important. One of the Just walking, and all of a sudden, they attacked me. My Agnes, Agnes, why do you want to kill my only son for me, Agnes? Because of this, your useless daughter. Hey, Agnes, what have I done to you, Agnes? Hey, hey, hey! Hey, hey! What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Hey. You heard what happened to him? Okay, you came to check up on him. Don't know that, don't know if he's dead. Yes, he came, he came now. He's a dead man. He's a dead man. Now, get out of this place. I said, get out of here. Shut up, shut up. Get out. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Idiot. I see that. You see that? I don't want to sit near my company again. Eh? Okay, if come to, to, to find out if he kept his dead. Don't worry. Agnes, Muna Iga. Muna Iga for Agnes. And for you. You've learned the lesson. Agnes! Where is this woman that does not want me to have peace in this community? Where's your mother? Where's your mother? Hey, in the name of Jesus Christ. Father God, I bind every principle of power. Amen. Every manipulation. Amen. Every enchantment. Father, I destroy them. In fire. the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Christ. Holy Ghost fire. fire. Holy Ghost fire. Fire. So what is it? Eh? You this hypocrite. Why have you decided to show your face in my house? Why won't you allow me and my children to serve our Lord God in peace? That person should go to you. Why not allow me and my son to have peace? Why have your son and his bunch of criminals decide to kill my son? Yes, and I know you are involved in this matter. Me? Ha. You don't know what you're talking about. Because my Bible tells me that I do not fight against flesh and blood, but against principalities and powers. Yes. Rulers of this wicked world, witches and wizards. Let me tell you, my
My Lord God said in Exodus 19, 19, that he shall fight my battle and I will hold my peace. Yes. I don't know the stupid physical battle you are talking about because I do not engage in anything. Physical battle. physical battle. Your son and his bunch of criminals, hoodlums, went and attacked my son. Eh? They want to kill my only son for me. And I'm sure, Agnes, you are aware of this plan to kill my only son. Look, they cannot kill my son. For as long as I live, nobody can kill my son. Go and ask, bring out your son. Bring him out to explain to me why he wants to kill my only son. Else, we end this matter in the police station. Else what? What do you mean else? Let me tell you, the Bible. my Bible tells me that right from the time of John the Baptist, the kingdom of God suffered violence. Yes. And only the violence, they can take it by force. Let me tell you, you are not a man of God as you profess. You only deceive him people. They don't teach you good doctrine. They don't teach you anything in that your church. Maybe my son did a little prayer exercise. Yes. Prayer warrior. He taught your son how to pray and march in the Lord. And you are here claiming that my son beat up your son. If your son is man enough, he's, if he's truly a, a child of God, he will know how to use this Bible and fight his battle. Yes. Hey, yes. Spiritual. Yes. I don't blame you. You had a son who is a, a spiritual thief and hoodlum. Yes, that is your son. A hoodlum and thief. But spiritual. So Wandra, you know what? Since you don't want to bring out your son, to explain what my son did to him. Look, I'll meet you in the police station. I will go no over there. Not a thief, oh. not a thief, oh. We are children of God. Yes. We don't fight with sick and battle. Yes. Our God is fighting for us. Yes. Where is your brother? I don't know. Are you sure? I've not seen him since so. What is he talking about? I don't know. Hey! Oh, yeah. This boy will not kill me. This boy will not kill me. My dear, that was what happened. He threatened to call the police and arrest me and my son. <laughs> Wonder shall never end. So, Instead of him to warn his son to stay away from your daughter Amaka, he's threatening you with the police. Oh. Hmm. This man and his son is bent on ruining what God has in plan for me and my family. But they will not succeed. I have warned my daughter Amaka that next time I see that boy anywhere around her, I will skin her alive. Hmm? My dear. Because you really need to warn her. You need to warn her seriously. This is getting out of hand. Eh? It is no longer for you. Anyway, my cousin extends his greetings. Ah, my in-law. Hey! <laughs> How is he? <laughs> hey! Hey, wo. is he still coming back this Christmas? Ah, ah. That's why I'm here now. Eh? He said we should gather the elders so that by november you will come and see your kinsmen so as to make things easier for him hey if any in our name is hey i go back to my home no problem no problem my daughter will be ready for him of course eh? just tell her to stay away from that useless boy ah, hmm. it has ended already good hmm. hey Jerry, good My love, I'm sorry about what my brother did to you. I didn't know that my brother would have this kind of heart to, to do this to you. Eh? Hey, he wants to spoil your fine face for me. Sorry. Sorry. No, I'm... It's, I'm sorry. it's fine, it's fine. Sorry. It's fine. It's fine. <sighs> well, it's all in the past now. That's... That's just that. I'm happy to see you back to your feet again. Ah, at least now I can be with you. It's for you. Me too. And how is your father? I hope he's not still planning to take actions against my brother. No. I... No, he's not. Sorry. He's not. Uh, I discussed with him and he dropped the case. But he sounded a. He dropped a serious warning. 
that when this, this happens, or if your brother tries to hurt me ever again, that he won't take it lightly with him. No, my, my brother won't do that again. I promise. I've already spoke with him. He won't do that again. I hope so. I mean, I suffered a great deal in the hands of your brother. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's fine. That reminds me. I checked my results and it came out very, very good. I see yours. Hope you've checked yours. Of course I did. How was it? Yes. Just tell me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I did perfectly well. Wow. I passed the cut of mark. Wow, that's <laughs> good news. That's good news. Sorry. It's fine. That's good news. I mean, our dreams to going to the highest station is kicking off greatly. If I, anytime you see the both of them again, just inform me. We need to teach that boy a lesson. You want to deal with that boy again? Are you sure his father has not reported this case to the police? Because me, I do not want to sleep in the police cell again. No, no. I don't think. But though he threatened to, I don't think he has informed the police. Are you sure? I'm very sure now. I know why I'm saying this. The first one we, we, we did was a very big risk. And that risk is what I am not ready to take again. Yes, not even for you. I, I, I don't have anybody that will come and, uh, and bail me from the police custody. So please, I don't want to take that risk again. Nobody will arrest us. Yeah, nobody will arrest us. You understand? I know what I'm doing. See, this time we just have to be careful, okay? And be on guard. You understand? Of course, I'm always on guard. But that is by the way. I spoke with Kendola. And then he said we should uh, prepare to come over by month end. Mm -hmm. Yes. At least we have to go to the city. Make good money. Ah! Make good money. Uh, very soon we'll leave. You know me, I have big dreams. I have a lot of things I need to achieve. And my sister is not in that big dreams. <laughs> in fact, your sister is the head of the dreams I've been having because these days I don't know I've been seeing her in my dreams lately I don't know what is happening for my sister can never be in your dreams if I take it off your head that is by the way um, <clears throat> since things are working as planned I'll have to go and see my mother you understand let me tell her the good news I think I will let me let me just go home and rest I need to sleep do you have any... Oh, Biora. Where did you say you're going? And what are you going to do? What I've told you now is an online work hmm? with Yahoo Mail. All I, ha all I have to do is just stay awake in the night and do what I'm asked to do. At the end of the month, the white men will pay me. Eh? White men? Did you work for them? How can you be in Nigeria here and work? And then white men, Oyibama will pay you. What works like that? How do I explain this to you now? See, the most important thing is, once I go there, I will make money and change our lives. Eh? So at least as a deacon, as if you drive with your car and go to the church, how will you feel? You man like here. You want to go and join them and start scamming people? Scammer! How can you work in coal and then night they will pay you? You work in Nigeria, Oibo man will pay you. Oibo man, Ojigogwa, Onyocho Ojigogwa. Mama, that is how the business works. Where are they doing this business? Where is your office? Where is the market? Okay. And now you're talking, see, it's, it, the place is called HK. Home for Kings. You understand? Please. That is the place. See, that is where we do the work. And I'm not the only person doing it. If I go there, we have many other guys that are doing the same thing. You see? You see where you have landed yourself? Obiora, you see? You see where your stubbornness have landed you? 
I've been pleading with you. Learn this trade, you refuse. Learn sewing, you refuse. Learn tailoring, uh, learn a bricklaying, you refuse. Learn babin, you refuse. You choose not to do anything at all with your life. Now you want to go and join them and start scamming people. I, I do not say I'm scamming anybody. Just work for white men and they will pay me. You are putting this. You are taking this thing too far now, Nene. Hmm. You think I don't know where you're getting at? You think I don't know your plan? Obiora, you want to go and join Yahoo, Yahoo, Yahoo people? Mother, I don't know what you're talking you're about. You're not going I've anywhere. I've said my own. I'm, I'm leaving. You're not this going thing. anywhere. What do you mean? You, you Mother, not go. this thing. Uh, my friend, I'm sorry for you. Uh, I heard you beat your cut off mark. Mm -hmm. uh, so, what's your next plan now? Would you? Uh, what other plans do I have? I'm just waiting to see if we be uh, admitted into the university. So that I'll leave this village for you people. Oh. <laughs> uh, so, you want to leave me alone in this village? Mm -hmm. You can come and say. Ah. So, now that's not fair, my friend. Eh? Uh, I also heard that. You know, now you came over. <laughs> that your so bit is cut off work. Of course. My Ikem is very smart and mm. clever. Mm. He always beats all his cut off mark. Mm. <laughs> uh, I also heard that um, both of you applied for the same school. <laughs> Ju. <laughs> Ooh, Ju. Uh, you and Gossi. <laughs> eh? like that now. Nah. Every time you need a purity, pure gebi, pure geba, looking for new Gossi. No, no, it's not like How that. How did you hear? Who ah. told you? I always have my ways now. 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 Would you? How many times did I call you? I don't know. This is your gossip to put you into trouble in this village. Do not. It's real. And I'll be here when it will happen. Do not put me in this. Anyways, we did. And we are praying to be admitted into the same university so that we have peace. And we'll be able to express our love very well. You know, we've really passed through a lot in the hands of his father and my mother. So I just pray that God will make it so happen. Nemo, I pray so, I pray so. Because ah, people have got so much pressure because of this school stuff. Pressure, ah, ah. Would you, eh? Every time school, school, school. Ah, I pray so, my sister. What can we do? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Would you? Mm -hmm. So, that's thinking. Mm -hmm. It's not what you are thinking. No, it's, it's no, not. No, it. I, how can I be thinking? I want to. I want just want to go and see if he has any new information. <laughs> information minister. Our admission. Uh, information minister. <laughs> my friend, my friend. Apo <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you escort me. Why not? Let's go now. Let's go. Uh, you two like man. Uh? You, you two like gossip. Uh, you two like gossip. Let's every go. time you pure, like pure, 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 Never 
Tinha quara is in no long coin wire. Jay Hilly. Who moved Jay Hilly? Agnes, Aggie. Eh? Aggie, my friend. No. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God. This one you came to our house this afternoon. My dear, I did not just come for nothing. I saw something that made me to come here. My eyes have seen my ear. What could that be? I saw your daughter, Amaka, with that useless village boy. He hey! This again. Again. Huh. again? Hmm. You are sure it's my daughter that you saw? Hey, Epumisi. Am I blind? I said I saw Amaka with that useless Ikenna. Hmm. At the village square, discussing you know? So Amaka have gone back to Ikenna again. So she is still seeing that boy, that good for nothing boy. She will come back and meet me in this house. Amaka will come back and meet me. I will skin her alive. Better do. Hey, what should I do to this girl? I thought she has stopped too. Anyway, thank you for this piece of information you've given me. I will know how to handle it from here. Good. Good. Let's go inside so that I can give you something to eat and finish cooking up. No, don't worry. As you can see, I'm just coming back. Eh? We just dismissed. It's like uh, Ogechi is not back. No. Mm. Ogechi, she must have gone to see her friend before coming back. Oh. so bad. Please, do something about it. Oh? I will. Uh, I have a lot of work to do. Eh? I have to mark my assignment, you know, write my lesson note. Oh, you are bad. Biko, do something about it. Oh. It's I getting will. out of hand. Oh. Hey! What will I do to this girl? What have I not done? What will I do to Amaka to stop seeing me again now? Why can't she understand what is before her? And choose the good thing and leave this bad and good for nothing boy. Hey. I hope it's not what I'm thinking. Amaka. Hey! Amaka! What is wrong with you? Nothing, Mama. I'm fine. You are fine? This is what fine people do. Hey, Amaka. Hey! These days, you don't do anything at home. It's either you're sleeping or you're very tired, lazying around. You hardly do any chores from morning till night. Hey, Amaka. Are you still a virgin? As in, is your virginity still intact? No, answer no, me! No, yes, answer no. me! Have you gone down? Yes, ma. Why am I even wasting my time? Okay, T. Hey! I said it that this girl will bring shame upon me. You are finally, you are finally succeeded, eh? You are finally succeeded. Hey, Amaka, I will kill you this time. Okay, okay, Yes, mommy. Okay, Chi, come. Yeah, 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 you will see money inside. Collect the money. Rush to John, the chemist boy. Tell him to give you pregnancy test. Bring it for me. Bring it here. Na 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 na. Okay, come on, come on. Are you sure? Mama. Hey. Okay, go, 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 go. Hey. I said you don't disgrace me, sister. You are finally. What offense did I commit, God? Why did you allow this shame and reproach to befall me? 
Who do I run to and who do I talk to, Amaka? Why have you decided to rub shame on my face? What have you done? Hey. Amaka, why have you and your brother decided to rub shame on my face? God, why did you allow this shame and reproach upon me? What have I not done to raise you and your brother? Amaka, what is this? What is this, Amaka? Is it because your father is no more? Is that why you and your brother have decided to rub shame on my face? Hey! Amaka, look at me and newly ordained deaconess in the church. What will I tell them? What will people say, Amaka? Amaka, can you end the madikeku? Hey, whoa! Amaka! Amaka, how could you? Amaka, what, how did I wrong you? Amaka, what is this? Amaka, 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 what will they say, Amaka? What will they say? Hey, will you get out of my face? I say, get out! Come back here, come back here, come back here. Listen to me and listen very well. Make sure no one hears of this. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? Get out of my face! Hey! didn't allow me to come out so I had to sneak out I'm sorry it's fine but you look sick and weak hope all is well all is not well again what's the matter what happened I'm pregnant you what I'm pregnant are you sure about this? I'm very sure about it. My mother even had to do manual tests to confirm it. It's fine, my love. I will do everything in my power to take care of you and our unborn baby. After all, I'm my father's only child. He want me to get married on time and bear him grandchildren. I believe you understand. But that won't stop us from achieving our dreams of going into the high institution. We'll walk through this together. And after you've given birth, we'll go back to school and continue chasing our dreams. Are you sure about this? My mother is already angry. Because it concerns you and your father. That's why she hasn't come to see you people. And she is afraid to lose her position in the church. So how sure are you that she's going to accept this? Well, both of them have to put aside their differences. I mean, we are talking about a baby here. Dear blood, our baby. They will have to put outside their differences and find a way to settle. I am afraid and confused right now. But I will do my possible best to take care of you and the baby. We just have to work through this together. I need you to be strong for us and for the unborn baby. Please. I will, my love. When I, once I get home, I will discuss this with my father. I will make him see reasons, and I believe he will understand. I 
brains. Don't worry. Everything's going to be alright. Okay? Amaka? Yes, Mama. Come. Amaka, sit down. Yes, Mama. Amaka. Yes, Mama. I hope you understand how hard things are for us in this family. Yes, Mama. I hope you understand that I'm a single mother, a widow, working hard, struggling to take care of you and your siblings. Despite the fact that your brother, Ubiora, have decided to be stubborn and on his own. And God knows I've been trying my best to put him right. Yes, Mama, I do. Amaka. And you know that recently I was made a deaconess in the church. And it's from the money that the church pays me. And the little I make from my petty trade, that is what I use to take care of you and your siblings. Amaka. Yes, ma'am. I have better plans for us. The plan is that you will marry Anthony, the son of our church member, when he comes back from Canada. Because this is the only way and means for us to be delivered from this abject poverty that has befallen this family since your father's death. But you see, you are planning to ruin all these things for this family by becoming pregnant. Mamaka. You now see the reason why you must get rid of this pregnancy. Mama, I will not commit abortion. No. It is a sin in the sight of God and even man. Mama, this is what you are preaching to people against. Oh, shut up your mouth before I walk on. What do you mean what I preach against? Don't I preach against fornication, Amaka? Why did you go and fornicate? Eh? Why must you go and sleep with a man be be before wedlock? As a child of God, where are you supposed to do it in the first place, Amaka? Mama, he loves me. Eh? Oh, you, don't get me angry this morning. Amaka. Amaka, you will get rid of this pregnancy. Later, we ask God for forgiveness. God is merciful. He will forgive us. But Mama, what if we do not get a chance to ask for forgiveness? Amaka, there's always a chance. God will give us a chance. God is always merciful. He understands. That is why He is God. He will always give us a second chance. Just listen to me. Mama, what if we have a choice? What other choice do we have in this matter now? Eh? He cannot come marry me. He's the only child of his father, and his father cannot reject a child from him. Oh, I'm not going to meet you. Who will marry you? Ikena. God forbid. It will not happen. Mama, Ikena will marry me. Ikena is not good. He's no good. Why will you want to spend your life with that good for nothing boy that does nothing but roam around in this village? That is who you want as a husband. It will not happen, no, Amaka. Amaka, it will not happen. He can now not marry you. And I hope you've not told him about this pregnancy. I've told him already. What? He can now. He can now. Papa. I've 
to do things time without numbers. Or you will never listen to your father. Now, look at the mess you are putting yourself in. My son, having a child outside well -known. What do you think the judge would think about you? Papa, it doesn't matter what the judge would think. This is about family. This is about my happiness, Papa. This is about your only child. What have I not done to you as my only child? What have I not done to make you happy as my only son? You have grown to be a man. Happiness is not the only thing that matters in a man's life. Responsibility matters. Decision making. Values. Religions. Rights. Every other thing matters in a man's life. A man doesn't just do things because he wants to make himself happy. Papa, that is why I want to take responsibility for my actions. All I'm asking is for your help. A real man takes responsibilities of his actions and does how to maintain good values. Papa, I love Amaka so much and I really want to marry her. All I'm asking for is your help. Because you You can now. Even if I accept for you to marry Amaka, Agnes will not accept. Papa, you just have to accept first. It takes two to fight. Once you accept, we'll look for a way to convince her. Mm. Ah. Okay. Again now. Again now. Look at the situation. You've cost me. Sorry, Papa. My dear, this children of mine wants to kill me. I don't know what I did wrong to them. This is a very difficult situation. Eh? But you have a very good idea now. Your idea is good. Why has she, why has she refused to accept it? She is the Adao. She needs to marry a rich man. She needs to marry from a rich family so that she can bring her family out of poverty. Look at me. Give me a medal, Mazia. I wish you understand this thing you just said. I wish you understand it. Hey, it's like since she has refused to accept your own, I have another very good idea. Because I cannot disappoint my cousin. Iman hey, now. Hey, so cool. Yes, Mama. Hey. What are you doing inside? I was washing. You are washing clothes? Yes, Mama. Biko, 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 stop it. Henceforth, I don't want you to do any hard chores in this house. Just leave it for me and your sister. Eh, Inugo? Because, uh, come to think of it. I have really sat down to think and reason about our last discussion. And I think you're right. It is of no use about in this baby. He's my first grandchild. Eh? Nobody knows what this, what this child will be in future. Eh? So, no need. I have, yes, I have decided that you are going to keep 
the baby. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Mama. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> is it not, are you not my daughter? Henceforth, I don't want you to engage in anything hard or difficult in this house. Just leave it for me and your sister. Thank you. I will. After now, I will go and meet Aikina's parents. I'll meet the father. I'll try and make peace with him. So that we can start preparing for your marriage duty again. Mama, are you serious? Yes. <laughs> Thank you so much, Mama. Oh, my daughter. <laughs> I'll finally marry you again. Uh, so, this medicine, as I was coming back, I met uh, Mbochu, the woman that used to give me medicine whenever I'm pregnant. Yes. I took these drugs, this medicine, I drank it during my pregnancy to have all of you. This drug will make you and your baby strong. When you give birth, you give birth easily and smoothly. You will be healthy and your baby will be very, very healthy. So you'll be taking it. And you just have to start now. Thank you me. take it in the morning and in the evening. Mama, let me go and finish what I was doing. I'm taking it. Oh, no, 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 no. I said you start now. You take it now. Then in the evening, you take the remaining one. I will still go back. I've already told her to prepare more for me. Mm. Yeah. So I will still go back and get more from her. Drink more, drink more. Why don't you take some more? It's not bitter. Eh, eh, what's going on? It's okay now. My taste is nice. Eh, no, no, I said, I, I drink it like tea anytime I'm pregnant. Okay, mama, let me go and finish what I want. Eh, eh, leave it to I wash. Me and your sister, all of us, pampering you now. You are now the baby. Of the house, eh? Thank you, Mama. It was so easy for me, Sam. After now, the baby will go. We will call it miscarriage. We can now carry his useless and go. Daughter, you married their blood, boy, and we pray to me and my family from this attack. But, eh, and I do not need to be a more powerful. Ah, Maka, eh? Oh my God, please. 
Hey! Please, God. Never take a... Ah! 